guys welcome back to another video from Zendry's home style cooking so in today's video we are going to prepare some delicious stuffed chicken breasts with cream cheese and spinach okay but before I go ahead and break down all the ingredients as you already know guys if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel go ahead and do so we are now down to 68 videos and I'm sure you are enjoying all my videos let's go ahead and break down all the ingredients that we're going to need okay so first thing first, you're going to need some chicken breast. So I have four chicken breasts here. I've already washed them with lime and vinegar, remove all the fat, and it's ready to be seasoned. So what you need to do, you need to slightly cut your chicken breast because we're going to stuff the spinach and the cream cheese inside of that, okay? So it is also called butterfly, all right? So that's what I did, all right? So all four, cut open slightly well. This is a bit damaged, but it's okay. All right, as you can see, all four. All right, so we need to season our chicken. All right, so we're going to need some seasoning. I will be using some Sazon Tropical, some black pepper, onion and herb, some chili, chili powder to give it a little bit of, you know, kick, some garlic powder, chicken flavor, as well as paprika, and the paprika is just to add a little bit of color to my seasoning. Yes, we're going to need some spinach, and trust me guys, trust me guys, this is giving me a warm time. I don't like to prepare spinach, I always argue with myself, because this is two pack of spinach, and this is all I get from those two packs. So we're gonna need some cream cheese as well, and I'm using the original, you can use any cream cheese you choose, as well as some garlic spread, some extra virgin olive oil. I will be using some mozzarella cheese as well, but I'm not ready to use it, so it's inside the fridge. All right, so let's go ahead now and start seasoning my chicken breast. So first, I will be adding my onion and herb seasoning. So we're going to repeat this step both back and front, all right? Some chili powder. garlic powder right. some chicken flavored and some of my Sazon Tropical as well as my Paprika. Oh, one thing, guys, I did forget to add the salt. Okay, so one teaspoon of salt. So we're gonna rub that in. Okay, so let's start massaging. I want to get I'm going to turn it over like so. Guys, my chicken is now nicely seasoned as you can see. So I did both inside, outside, as well as the back of my chicken. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put this to marinate for at least 15 minutes and get started on my um, cream cheese mixture, okay? Okay, so guys, I'm going to go ahead now and start on the filling, right? So, for a clean bowl. So, I'm going to add my cheese, my cream cheese. Also to that, I will be adding my mozzarella cheese, and this is about half cup of cheese. I'm going to add some garlic spread. So 
of this amount of garlic spread. Also, I will be adding my spinach. Ooh. So we're going to combine all the ingredients together. Look at that guys, Woo. it's so yummy. So I will be adding just a little bit of onion powder to that. Not a lot, that is less than half teaspoon as well as some black pepper. Right? So I'm gonna continue mixing this. Right, so I'm just going to cover this and put it aside until I'm ready to stop my chicken breast. Okay, so now guys, it's time for me to start stuffing my chicken breast. Right. Put aside, start adding my cream cheese. I'm going to put them on a different. I'm going to put them on a different container once they're stuffed. Right. Okay. Take a generous amount, and remember, you don't want to stuff it too much, or else all that will just melt and run right out, which you don't mind. But hey. Could use a toothpick, but I don't have any toothpick. So. I don't need to change the container. Let me just remove it. I'm going to do another one and just finish up. A bit more, come on. Right. All the way in. I don't want it to be on the edge. be placing it in the oven for at least 30 minutes but you don't have to use the oven you can do it on your stove top but I prefer to do it that way okay. Right. okay so guys I will be using my cast iron skillet so I'm just going to add a little olive oil this is optional to the bottom in my chicken Right, 
So this is going in the oven for 30 minutes. Once that is done, then I'll come back and show you my delicious tough chicken. Okay. Since my chicken is now out of the oven, 30 minutes has passed, and as you can see, look at that guys. It's beautifully done. So I'm going to allow it to rest for 15 minutes before slicing it up and showing it to you guys. Okay? Hey guys, my delicious tough chicken breast with spinach and cream cheese. And trust me guys, it is so delicious. I did do an extra one separate from these. And when I taste it, it's the flavor is just bursting in your mouth with the cream cheese and the spinach. Oh my goodness, it is so delicious. I want you to try this recipe, guys. Try it and let me know how do you like it, okay? So once again, I hope you did enjoy today's video. And if you did, guys, please remember to give me a big thumbs up, share my videos with friends and family, leave a comment down below, and let me know what you think about today's video, okay? So, if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, guys, go ahead and do so. Invite your friends and your family. Subscribe to the channel. We're now down to 68 videos, okay? So go ahead and be a part of Zendry's Home Style Cooking. Let us grow together, okay? Great things in store for my channel. Alright, so once again, until I come your way with something delicious, from my kitchen to yours, take care of yourself and enjoy. Bye guys, see you in the next one.